What is up guys welcome back to another Black Clover reaction this is episode 66 so the arc is over we had our you know after arc party or like a fun episode where we get to see them coming back to their um, group uh, black balls basically and having fun so now there's a new opening song it shows like like a tournament type of arc incoming and you guys are excited uh, it doesn't seem like you guys are excited as much as you excited for uh, the Queen Witch Forest arc so I'm actually looking forward to seeing whatever that's coming up even if that's not exciting but I think we're gonna get to see a lot of characters and especially the two at the end on the like ending song apparently they are somebody to look forward to so let's go and check this episode out episode 66 people and obviously Asta's arm is healed we got few we got few allies and Vanessa sort out her well family problems with her mother and she got an epic new power which I'm looking forward to apparently there's like a restriction on them so I'm looking forward to them because a power that's just change fate itself it's kind of OP but I'm just glad there's a restriction and I like an anime that has a power control so it's not like a random power-ups and stuff so I'm really looking forward to it and you can see quite a lot of important main characters for this arc and now we're gonna get some more information about his powers it seems the eyes of the midnight sun secret okay also the bird has a secret too so looking forward to that Okay, that was an another king who was just yawning. I'm expecting that to be Diamond Kingdom. Now the Diamond Kingdom is more on a, like an alliance term. Oh, probably we won't get to see Diamond Kingdom. I think there's a chance, but let's see. Okay, the guy with the red hair showed up. Even though this opening song is so action-packed, I still like the last opening song. But uh, I don't know, let me know what you guys think. It's pretty good, it's pretty good. But the last opening song was Step Above, this one, for me. Okay, Golden Dawn. Asta is studying. Like everybody except Asta and Yami hide their true feeling. Really? Klaus is that dedicated? <laughs> okay there we go we're gonna get to see some arc oh okay never mind you know don't like it Okay, so we kind of getting like a recap which is good actually because there's been a lot of things all around the places. Okay, I didn't think it would be like this but it's an ongoing anime so I'm expect I should have expected this kind of stuff.
and the vermilion get taken down. Golem, eh? Rain of Silver, too. That's an OP power, though. That's a badass looking magic though. <laughs> Bell is also pretty OP. Okay, that's probably Lich. Oh, they didn't even actually show that scene. Oh, the traitor. Okay, that's the first part is done. Disloyal makes sense. Fana wasn't the strongest, honestly, compared to Veto. Thanks to Salamanta, she have like a huge attack power. But uh, where well, Veto, it's raw power, man. <laughs> Something would have. It's pretty much draw, wasn't it? <laughs> and as that was like the main, well, you know, key to defeat that, especially not having mana help him a lot uh, 
Okay, to that master, huh? <laughs> Okay, we don't know for sure. Well, it has to be the leader because they did say the sword was actually... The sword belonged to the leader, but they didn't say anything about the Grim Guard, but I can assume it's the same. That's funny because they both of them are not here. The disobey guy, the lazy guy basically, the guy who yarn a lot. He will I'm looking forward to seeing him who that is actually. I'm pretty sure he probably somebody shocking. into that true form basically into elves underwater temple dude that's my favorite arc so far just stop his heart yeah <laughs> you know getting irritated and we saw in this episode where he says he hate losing That was actually a nice combination attack, especially to go with that art we saw. <laughs> and here come the entrance dude but what Veto did here it's kind of messed up Did they though? No, nope, they did not. Yeah, this this is this is the most messed up part. See dance, I mean he dance and his legs get taken, she sings and her throat get taken. I wasn't like into those characters like big time, but still to see their dreams get destroyed. That was messed up. And to see Noel actually, you know, get finally getting a power up instead of just Asta getting power up and Yon, uh, you know, getting power up. It's nice to see others changing as well.
There come his third eye. Trust me, that's this part. This is where things get intense, and when Yami comes in, obviously. Night is here. Asta's job was basically to hold Veto off until Yami get here. He did it with everything he got, including growing power that he didn't even know that was bad. And we can see why Asta is powerful against these guys. This is something, a weapon that their leader used to use. So that weapon is not to be underestimated. And there we go. Yep. <laughs> Dude, look at just look at that. <laughs> Three eyed good. Cut through dimensions. That's an OP power to cut through dimension. Okay, these are the important information from this out. Well, some of the important information.
So that usual thing is happening with Asta. <laughs> Los. <laughs> Both good and bad. So that is bad. Well, they already started, but okay. So that means they are going all out. Okay, so we're getting some really important information here. That's a floating rock city. Alright, so this guy is going to be apparently really epic. So is the girl that's supposed to come follow him. Okay, so mainly this episode was just to recap people. Well, wait, that wasn't a girl. What the hell am I talking about? I like this ending. I really like this ending. somebody from Vermilion family actually you know this is my favorite ending even though the last ending was pretty good this is my favorite ending it's pretty simple mostly it's just uh, like a still image but it's, it's still good Yes, okay. When did this happen? Wait. Yeah, okay. Um, so that's the end of the episode. So it seems like they are making their moves, final moves. And he's smiling all of a sudden. So I'm expecting all of them to go all out. And also, you know, we have to remember there's a trader within the group as well. So, we know, okay, at least this is my prediction, at least I know, and I think this is going to happen. They're going to get the stones. I mean, after hyping up how much the elves can get power up with that stone, if they don't show the stone, it, it will eventually, somebody will eventually use the stones, right? And when they collect all of that stone, Lich probably become unbeatable and everybody have to join force to be together. Oh, I don't know how that's going to go, but I know they're going to get the stone. Especially the part where the traitor is, you know, the guy is dis, uh, disloyal. The white, the guy with the black hair and the white patches in the middle. So he's going to get the stones for Lich. He's probably going to get defeated when he do that. So when we get to see that, I'm looking forward to seeing how gonna get it and who he is like pretending to be that's all gonna be interesting and yeah that's pretty much it I don't think these guys know there is a 
well, they might actually have a let. They probably have a clue. I don't, I don't know, but I'm looking forward to it. Um, let me know what you guys think about this episode. Ma mainly it's a recap, so there's not much to say. It's especially right, right at the end, and some recap of some important information, especially the part where Queen mentioned quite a lot of stuff. And yeah, that's that's it from me. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the reaction. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. If you are new, don't forget to subscribe and press the bell symbol next to the subscribe button to get notification for the next video up. Also, if you go to the top right hand corner, you can vote if you enjoy Black Clover or not. Also, you can vote if you enjoyed this episode or not as well. And find my previous reaction if you do have time. That's it from me, people. Have a wonderful day or night, and see you guys with more videos.